Harry, you back here? Damn, just his badge. Maybe he's still around here somewhere. I know he'll listen to me if I can just get through to him. Yes, there you are. Harry, it's me. Hey, Harry, can you hear me? Listen, we're gonna figure out a cure, something better. Miles, I need help with these things. Got your messages. Sorry, I've been looking for my mom. Assume you saw Craven's dead? What? No. Gotta recreate the sound of Craven's bell. What sounds can I use around here? Perfect. Same shape as Craven's Bell. Even if it's a tenth the size. Serious echo chamber. Could come in handy. How do I get the bell into that hangar? That container looks promising. And if I drop it, I'll get some nice resonance. Yes! Recorded it. Now to ring the bell. There's the engine, but no power. Here we go. Yes, super echo recorded. Almost done. Just need a low frequency boost with a pulse. Something like... Helicopter's blades. Gotta get up there. Very funny. Let me transfer these sounds. Hopefully this will help. Come on, come on! Go! Whoa! Where? Nice job, Miles! Now let's save these people! That's more like... the pin for EMTs. They'll take care of these people. Good thinking. Subway is back. <laughs> Harry? That's Harry? Where'd he go? 
We'll find him later. Right now, we need to save your mom and Genki. That did it! Spider-Man, it's you! Yeah. The doors are stuck. We gotta move these tendrils somehow. You need to hurry. All these tendrils are alive. Connected. There's gotta be a central nerve somewhere. Bingo! Let's hit a nerve. He's pulling back! But not enough. They're still trying to get into the trains. There's gotta be another nerve cluster around here. Oh, wow. Too big for a single sonic burst. Think we can chain some together? Yeah. We're gonna need time to sync up. How much time does it need? How much time? A minute? Maybe a little more? Keep your spidey sense sharp. This might get wild. Spider-Man. You're okay. What happened? I took your advice. I let go of some things that didn't serve me. really sucked. I thought I was gonna die. My life was flashing before my eyes. You're good, I... man. That time when we went mini-golfing for my birthday and I got that hole-in-one to win, I cheated. I could pick up the ball and dropped it in when you weren't looking, and I... You were eight. And honestly, I never liked the sandwiches you traded for at lunch, but I went along with it because I knew how much you loved my mom's banchan, and I'm seeing someone new, by the way. Her name's Andy, and she's great, and please don't kill me, but I just thought of a sequel for Sweet Nautica tonight. Wait, 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 Andy, from Kim? Oh, she's real cool. <laughs> Thanks for saving us. Look, I'm sorry I've been so busy. I'll do better. Make the time to hang out. Be careful. Genki, let's get uptown. I'll make you something good for dinner. Next step? Find Harry. No sign of Harry. What's that? Happy birthday, Em. They say time heals all wounds. That's a lot. Every day without you is worse than the last. If I lose Harry, I... I don't know what I'll do. Norman's really hurting. I need to find Harry and save him. Haven't heard from MJ in a while. I should give her a call. You do? <laughs> You've hit the nail on the head. Finally! Top story. Everybody's talking about it. This is editor material. Editor? Congratulations. Your first assignment, write more juicy stuff by tomorrow morning. Drama, controversy, just like this. Like this. Get writing! <sighs> MJ. I, uh, didn't get fired from the Bugle. In fact, I think I, I got a promotion. Hey, that's what you wanted, right? Yeah, I, I thought it was. Then that's... Great. Hey, listen. Something's gone wrong with Harry. What... what happened? Well... Hang on, someone's at the door. It's kind of hard to explain. Just promise me you'll stay away from him, okay? MJ? MJ! Where's... Harry. Pete? You look tense. Coffee?
We need to talk. You must get tired making the world a better place every single day. But I can help. All you have to do is let me. This isn't you. Wrong. This is the real me. I finally have the power to realize our vision. Are you giving up on me? Harry, we need to get that thing off you. Do not call us a thing. your mom and Genki. Spider-Man. You're okay. What happened? I took your advice. I let go of some things that didn't serve me. Come on. That really sucks. I thought I was gonna die. My life was flashing from my eyes. You're good, man. That time when we went mini golfing for my birthday and I got that hole in one to win, I cheated. I could pick up the ball and dropped it in when you weren't looking, and I. You were eight. And honestly, I never liked the sandwiches you traded for at lunch, but I went along with it because I knew how much you loved my mom's banchan, and I'm seeing someone new, by the way. Her name's Andy, and she's great, and please don't kill me, but I just thought of a sequel for Sweden Onagon, and I... Wait, wait, wait. Andy from Kim? Ah, oh, she's real cool. <coughs> Thanks for saving us. Look, I'm sorry I've been so busy. I'll do better. Make the time to hang out. Be careful. Genki, let's get uptown. I'll make you something good for dinner. Next step? Find Harry. I'll take downtown. I got uptown. While I'm looking for Harry, I should check in on some other things. Nearby. 
some snooping. All right, Droney. What do you know that I don't? <laughs> A map of a base. I think I can dig around to see what's waiting for me there. Looks like you've been to two other blinds. Maybe Harry's back at his place. Can't hurt to check. Maybe if I explore the rest of the blinds, I'll find myself a base. No sign of Harry. What's that? Happy birthday, Em. They say time heals all wounds. That's a lot. Every day without you is worse than the last. If I lose Harry, I... I don't know what I'll do. Norman's really hurting. I need to find Harry and save him. Haven't heard from MJ in a while. I should give her a call. I hate this. I love this. You do? <laughs> You've hit the nail on the head. Finally! Top story. Everybody's talking about it. This is editor material. Editor? Congratulations. Your first assignment, write more juicy stuff by tomorrow morning. Drama, controversy, just like this. Like this. Get writing! <sighs> MJ. I, uh, didn't get fired from the Bugle. In fact, I think I, I got a promotion. Hey, that's what you wanted, right? Yeah, I, I thought it was. Then that's... Great. Hey, listen. Something's gone wrong with Harry. What... what happened? Well... well hang on, someone's at the door. It's kind of hard to explain. Just promise me you'll stay away from him, okay? MJ? Hell. Come on. 
Come on, him. MJ, pick up. Hey, it's MJ. You can leave Damn a message, it. but why would you? If it's important, just, you know, text. Please be okay. Spider-Man, how are you feeling? Anxious? Panicked? I meant, uh, physical symptoms. Soreness? Fatigue? Yes. Wait, symptoms? I've been looking through years of research notes. The symbiote channels a... Uh, collective consciousness. That hive mind I was in. Was is optimistic. It may still be inside you. What? Nothing to panic about, but perhaps you should come to the lab for some tests. Can't, Doc. Bigger problems. Gotta go. Hang on, MJ! I should have been home! MJ! Where's... Harry. Pete? You look tense. Coffee? We need to talk. You must get tired making the world a better place every single day. But I can help. All you have to do is let me. This isn't you. Wrong. This is the real me. I finally have the power to realize our vision. Giving up on me? Harry, we need to get that thing off you. Do not call us a thing. Harry, we are not Harry. Talk to me! 
I'm done talking! Done begging for validation! From you! From anyone! Validation? Ah! This is about your job! It's about me! Hey! Not my job in this stupid house! And for once, it's not about you! It's about me! MJ, what do you mean? You stay out of this! I'm finally in control! <laughs> Don't want to hurt her! Just talk to me! Shut up! There. No more. 
remember your book? You said you want to help people! Nobody read it! Nobody cares! That's not true! If I helped one person, it was worth it! I read it! It helped me! All I do is help you! MJ, my life is constantly interrupted! The pain! My life is
This isn't what you want. How do you know what we want? You're Mary Jane Watson. You want the truth. Yes. I want the truth. symbiote. For months I've been trying to be something I'm not. I'm glad you're back. Sorry. It wasn't you. And I wasn't me earlier. Pete, I... Pete, it... it was like some kind of hive mind in there. I saw you. And Harry, he, he was going after this rock. Miles is at City Hall. Go. I love you. I love you. some of this thing inside him. I see. I think I can clear it out of him. But only if I go to the source. I'm going in with you. What's the plan here, Lee? Find Spider-Man. All of this dark matter should lead us toward him. Alright. On my way. Where are we, anyway? We are inside Spider-Man's mind. You've seen what those creatures do to people around the city. They get in your head. Twist your desires. Mad they stole your routine? I know you're joking, but you're making my point. This thing fears my power for some reason. And I, we, are 
are the only ones who can find where it lives. So we clear this thing out at the root, and Spider-Man's free? That's the plan. All right, then. Hold on than I thought. All right. Weaken the symbiote, take back control, use our powers to save Spider Man. Where do we start? We have to find the source of his pain. Follow me. I'll try and lead you to where it's darkest. But I can't promise what we'll find. Spider-Man would think about this place. Most of us are here because of him. Down here, I think I found something. I think... Miles! Solved. That's not what Pete thinks. No, but it might be how he feels. All these villains. He really thought the suit could solve it all. Is that me? You caused a lot of pain, man. A debt I will spend the rest of my life repaying. There's something up ahead. I haven't asked Pete about it in a long time. What's wrong with me? When you get caught up in one part of your life, it's easy for the rest to fall away. Look who's home. Come here. Oh, man. Balancing is a process, not a destination. does have the same effect in here. Yeah. I guess it does. <laughs> Looks like we're at feast. I built my life around this place. This will probably be the closest I'll ever get to seeing the inside of it again. Not that I deserve to. Lee, why 
did you do it? What did you want? Revenge. Norman Osborne's the reason my parents are dead. So I dedicated my life to making his hell. I'm sorry, Miles. Up there. That's the source. If we clear this out, we just might be able to save him. transfer all of my power into the symbiote. I think that could neutralize it. And free Peter. What'll happen to you? I guess we'll find out. <clears throat> okay. Well, if this is my last chance to say anything to you, forgive you. It's just not in me. But I can't carry this hate for you anymore, man. So let's set things right. You and me. We lost you. Guess I should thank you. I spent years of my life consumed with vengeance and lost everything for it. You two reminded me that that's not who I am. When you help someone, you help everyone. Where are you gonna go? To set things right. Your way. Wow. Reforming your greatest enemy. Can't say I've ever done that. Maybe MJ was right. Why would the city need me when it has you? I don't know. 
This city still looks like a two Spider-Man job to me. Let's get out of here. Norman, what are you doing? What are you gonna do with that thing? I think we're about to find out. You need to know. Harry's gone. Host and symbiote are perfectly fused. I'll find a way to save him. You can't. But you can still stop the symbiote. How? By killing the host. Please, save my boy. That suit's not an alien, is it? <laughs> it's time for a Miles Morales original, you know? One of one. <laughs> it looks good. <sighs> what happened, man? Harry got the meteorite. I, uh... I couldn't stop him. Connor said we can't save him, so we have... I can't lose him, Miles. I can't do this again. I saw May when I was... in your head. It's not your fault, Pete. She wanted to save you. To save all of us. She never thought about herself. Even when she was struggling to breathe. If May... 
my dad, if they were here, they would want us to stop thinking about them. They'd want us to help people, to fight. Harry's still in there. And we're gonna fight like hell to get him back. Call the play coach. All right. Let's split up. Cover more ground. You find the meteorite, I'll clear that nest out. You got it, Spider-Man. turn into symbiotes? You are safe here. Everyone you love is safe here. My head. I have to find a way out. Why would you leave? We are here. You can be too. You. Peter. Us. This isn't where I belong, Harry. Neither do you. Come on, Miles! Come on! Let us heal you. Bring us, Peter. It's not the way, Harry! You know that! <laughs> in trouble. Pete, I saw the meteorite. It's under the Harlem subway station, next to the bridge. Hey, everything all good with Haley? Not yet, but you still owe me a few more minutes. Hang tight! Haley! No! What are you doing here? I was... I was trying to save... You. You're incredible. I, I like you so much, and I think you like me. Do you want to go out? Hey, on a... Date? <sighs> Is that a yes? <laughs> well, it's a date then. After all this is over. Pete! I'm on the way! P! 
I'm here. Are you finally ready? Harry, I can't. Seeing a rock. No? Hold on. I'm nearly to you. Thanks for coming, Pete. We want to show you something. Harry, what are you? We are healed. Finally free. <laughs>
Central Park Reservoir. The water system. Pumping goo everywhere. Adding more and more people to the hive mind. If all those symbiotes get out of Manhattan. Goodbye, Earth. Hello, planet goo. The meteorite is the source of all the power, right? Creating goo, creating symbiotes. But it was useless until Harry repaired it. Yeah. And that particle accelerator is what damaged it in the first place. Cut off a piece at low power. Right, so what if we crank the power up? Like way past 11. Might destroy it. And free everyone connected to the hive mind. Theoretically. But that reservoir's gotta be mobbed with symbiotes. And you know Harry's not gonna let that rock out of his sight. Unless he sees something he wants more. Me. Just, you know, for illustrative purposes. Harry's still Harry. He thinks he's healing the world. But the dream isn't complete without... His best friend beside him. I can lead Harry away from the meteorite. And I can handle all the symbiotes. While I grab the space rock. For illustrative purposes. All right. Fire up the accelerator. <sighs> no more hive mind. World saved. We all get churros? <laughs> Theoretically. Pete, what Connor said about Harry being too far gone. If you can't save him, are it you won't ready? come to that. You two will be able to destroy the rock in time. Let's heal the world. For real this time. Somewhere in that thing? So are Harry and his friends. Here. I figured you could use a sonic touch. <sighs> They're just standing there. What are they waiting for? Look, I can't thank you both enough for everything. Come on, bro. We're the spider team. <sighs> Don't anyone forget it? Hey, buddy! You gonna sit in there and play with your pet rock all night? It's you and me, Harry. Like we always wanted.
rest of the hive. Just a normal rock. I can also end the world. Still on me. Plus one isn't invited to our high school reunion, Harry! Harry! Thank <laughs> you. 
Heal the world with you! Not like this! The meteorite! You took it from us!
Give me back my friend! We are your friend. No, we don't. It'll kill them. And then it'll kill you. Let's heal the world, Pete. Together.
of you. some room. I don't know if it's gonna work, but I gotta try. Pulse is weak. We gotta move. What have you done? What have you done to him? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm coming with you. Wait. There are traces of brain activity, but his chances of coming back are very slim. Just keep him alive.
Get the G serum ready. ASAP. For the last few years, tragedy has tried to tear the city apart. But we somehow kept going. We battled sickness, evil, cataclysm. We are tired, anxious, stressed, numb. But we have never lost hope. The city needs to heal. We're all ready to return to normal, but what is normal? What if it no longer exists? Over the last half hour, I've talked about how these events have changed me. But what about you? In this ongoing series, I will be talking with people throughout the city, exploring our new behaviors, new routines, new thoughts and feelings. I hope you'll join me on this journey. This has been Mary Jane Watson, and you're listening to The New Normal. <sighs> Episode one, done. Nice. <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, are these good to go? In a minute, I want to show you something first. Okay. It has molasses in it. Yum, I'll take those. <laughs> Thanks again for the donation, Peter. Have you talked to Miles about? Not yet. <sighs> you ready? Uh, Miles. I've been meaning to talk to you uh, about some. Uh, I mean, I have been talking to you there all, all the time. It's 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 great uh, to talk. So many good talks. Uh, I just haven't been talking to you about what I should have been talking to you about, Pete. Uh, wait, uh, let me start again. I got this. All of it. Go be Peter Parker for a while. Are you... are you sure? It's... it's a big city. I can handle it. As long as I can still call you for advice. You don't need it. Maybe not now, but... There'll come a time. I'm here for you. Always.
What do you want? The Spider-Men. You know who they are, don't you? Why? They ruined my son. Good. We all have to experience loss. Even you, Norman. What are you writing? The final chapter. Hungry. Food's almost ready. Why don't you go show her your essay? He worked so hard on it. guy in Harlem, probably seen him volunteering in the city, helping out his city council mom, and trying to live up to his hero dad. Yeah. Haley, this is Albert. Uh, hi. Nice to meet you. Oh, and uh, <laughs> this is my daughter, Cindy. <laughs> 